everything within her tells her she's Nigerian. I'm looking at this girl and I'm thinking, are you really sure of what you're saying? Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. How are you all doing? What's up? Hope you're well. If this is your first time of seeing this, Omalicha. Okay, Omalicha, you're welcome. I'm sure you're wondering, why is she referring to herself as an Omalicha? Yeah, I will tell you just in the course of this video i want you to stick to the end and you will know why i refer to myself as that okay right so um yeah and to all my returning friends i love you i heart you thank you so much let's just jump right into the video before i get told off okay now without taking much of your time from the title of this video you can already tell what we're going to be talking about south africans wishing they were nigerians how possible is that I mean, how possible is that? That is not true. Well, this is not a clickbait because this is exactly what happened. And I'm going to tell you the story now. I mean, you guys know, of course, you know the beef that's been going on between Nigerians and South Africans. I mean, you know it. I don't need to tell you. You know it. A lot of water has passed under the bridge between South Africans and Nigerians. And to be honest with you, I cannot sit here and deny that things have gone wrong. I cannot sit here and deny that things have gone haywire. I mean, South Africans have, you know, expressed their displeasure as to how Nigerians behave in South Africa. I mean, It's not been a good thing to, to talk about, you know, me being Nigerian, I mean, I've made videos in the past where I've talked about these things and, you know, well, there's nothing much we can do about this than just talk and talk and talk and hope for a change. But in all of these things, it will surprise you. It will shock you to know that there are still some South Africans who truly, truly, truly love Nigerians. Okay. I'm not talking about marriage here. I'm not talking about friends here. I'm just talking about some South Africans who truly, genuinely love Nigerians, regardless of all that's been going on. Okay. This just tells you that we are one whether you like it or not south africans we are one and you know i've said it before that you are unique in your own way i mean you are different from other africans in how you carry yourselves like you know not traveling outside of, of your country that much staying there to fight for your country i've said this in my previous videos but in this scenario i came across a video of a south african girl very beautiful girl talking about how she wishes she was Nigerian, okay? Her mother is Nigerian, sorry, her mother is South African, father South African, she has no trace of Nigerian in her blood, but she wishes to be Nigerian. And how did that come about? Okay, let me tell you, let me tell you the full gist. Apparently, she said that prior to 2015, she had never met a Nigerian in her life. She had never seen a Nigerian. But I think there was an event that took place in South Africa, a very big event. I can't remember what she called it now. And she said during that event, a lot of Nigerians were in South Africa, Zimbabweans, people came from the UK, America to attend this event. And there she met um, a Nigerian guy. He walked up to her and they had a little chat. And she immediately, you know, got along with him she immediately you know it clicked between the both of them but the thing is obviously she didn't she said that it didn't work out for both of them in terms of relationship because they had to go back to nigeria but within the short space of time that she got to mingle with nigerians she fell in love with them she talked about you know the fact that she loved nigerian culture based on what you know they told her based on what she had heard and then she visited nigeria and oh my oh my she could not believe how they you know how loving and accepting nigerians were regardless of what has been said over the past the thing is nigerians are great people nigerians are lovable people it's just that i don't know what has happened has come over some group of nigerians who go to south africa and tend to you know 
embarrass us or disgrace us over there but there are a lot of good nigerians which is what i want south africans to know she said she loves the nigerian accent she loves the food she wants you know and then she went ahead to give herself the name omalicha <laughs> so omalicha it's an Igbo language Igbos come from the eastern part of nigeria so she gave herself that name omalicha sorry omalicha which means beauty you know and she said feel free feel free to call me omalicha and the thing is she said everything within her tells her she's nigerian feel like i'm nigerian i want to be nigerian i breathe nigeria i and i'm looking at this girl and i'm thinking are you really sure of what you're saying right here on youtube she sits on her channel and talks praises about nigerians and that really surprises me because even right here on this channel where i've made videos about south africa i see the kind of comments i get from some people they go ahead to say oh you can never be south african you wish you were south african i detest nigerians i don't want to have anything to do with nigerians and i'm thinking don't say that because you do not know where the wind will blow you to it may not be you it may be your children now now there are interracial marriages everywhere everywhere you go you see different races getting married to each other what are you going to do the question is if your child tells you tomorrow daddy mommy i want to get married to a nigerian or i want to get married to a south african what are you going to do about it are you going to be that parent that will kick against marriages between your you know between races or nationalities just because of what's going on. I know that Nigerians haven't been that great. A lot of Nigerians haven't been that great in South Africa, but also there are a lot of great Nigerians in South Africa. You know, there are medical doctors, people who do legal businesses in, in South Africa. So let's not just look at the bad, let's look at the good as well. So this girl sits on her YouTube channel and talks about the fact that she wishes to be Nigeria. She breeds Nigeria, she loves the culture. When when she visited nigeria they accepted her for who she was and that's one thing about nigerians i mean i've never seen a nigerian you know say you know say bad things about other cultures you know or other countries you know that is one good thing about nigeria that i know that i can speak for i mean i'm not here to sit and support whatever bad things nigerians do in other countries but there are very good nigerians everywhere just as in now, in South Africa, you will find also that there are some not so good South Africans. So the point I'm trying to make here is the fact that interracial marriages are real. Okay, even right here on my channel, I've seen South Africans, you know, say I would love to visit Nigeria, but because of what's going on, I don't know how Nigerians are going to accept me in South Africa. But please feel free to visit Nigerians because I don't think that, you know, we it's gotten to that point where we now hate each other to the point where we don't want to see each other, we don't want to talk to each other, we don't want to mingle with each other. That is not a good thing, you know. So I saw this video and I thought I'll come here and share. I mean, if you want to see this video, please hook me up on Instagram. I'll leave my Instagram handle on the screen. I'm not going to give it out to everybody. I'm only going to give it out to people who are really interested in hearing from the horse's mouth, okay? That is what I'm going to do. So yeah, I just thought I'll come here and share this experience, you know? And for Nigerians, please, let us try as much as we can to change the narrative okay to change the narrative it's not a very good thing that you travel out of your country to other countries and all that they have to say about us is the negative i know that there are good nigerians you know in other countries and one thing i've noticed as well south africans also do say that nigerian women are amazing i mean they've never had any cause to worry about nigerian women in south africa you know they've expressed that nigerian women are there to do their thing quietly go their own way without upsetting anyone the problem seems to be with the men and it's just me craving your in indulgence when you go out there just you know be be that person that when you want to leave, they don't want you to leave. They'd rather you stay there, you know. I've seen a lot of South Africans say that when Nigerians were few in South Africa, you know, it was okay. It was not that bad. But with the migration of more Nigerians to South Africa, it became like a war zone. And that is exactly not what we want. We want peace, you know. So I thought I'd come here to share. Okay, so 
that's just what I've come here to say today. Nothing much. It's not all that serious, you know. So if you enjoyed this video, please, I beg you, I beg you, please like, share, subscribe. I'm trying to get to 3,000 subscribers and I hope that you will help me hit my target, okay? So like, share, subscribe and of course, you know I love you and I'll see you in my next video. Thank you everyone and to my South Africans, see ya bonga.